What's going on everyone? It's KT Pop here, coming at you with a brand new video. Man, it feels so weird doing this twice in a row. In the same jumper, no less. I am still in my unboxing <laughs> I was very obsessed with the TV show Boys Planet. Pretty much every single idol that came out of that show and went into a group, I started standing that group. And Toz is no exception. Toz have just had their first comeback since debut with the brand new song, New Shoes. I decided that I wanted to buy a couple of sets from MakeStar to try and win my second video call with the group. Unfortunately, I didn't win, but I still have the albums and I would love to unbox them with you guys. It's not even heavy. <laughs> it's like a rocket hit. I feel like these boxes always come with some sort of <laughs> Now I've just got a foreign rock on my lap, which is, uh, it's great. Korean it's a rock. Korean rock. It's a pretty big box for what I think is supposed to be inside here because I only bought two sets, which is four albums and pre-order benefits. So I don't really understand why they sent me such a massive box, but I'm sure we will find out. Here she is, not getting doxxed. I don't know why I gendered the box. That was kind of weird. Uh, I said I could open this with my fingers, so I'm gonna do that and prove everyone wrong. By everyone, I mean Josh. And not spill red wine everywhere. That looks kind of purple, does it not? Dun, 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 dun. I like you with the shoes. Fa, fa, follow me. Fa, 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 follow me. New shoes. <laughs> you gendered the box female and then you made it do a burlesque striptease. <laughs> okay, well, these albums are fucking huge. I did not realize how big they were. No wonder the box is massive. You see how thick those are? Like, Oh my God. And we can see the little pops here. I can already see. There is my main little baby boy. All right, let's pull them out. Oh, they're super light though. <laughs> Anything in the box? Yay. Oh my gosh. I honestly didn't know they were so big. I don't know what to do. Are they supposed to look like shoe box? Oh my God, that's so cute. They're supposed to look like shoe boxes because it's new shoes. Did they copy Taemin though? Taemin had that shoe box, remember? Oh my God. They are not ripping off Taemin. Their song is called New Shoes. So they decided to go with like this little cute shoe boxy kind of design, but it's not big enough for a shoe box, <laughs> but it's got that kind of vibe. So we've got two versions here. This green version. I don't know if the different versions have different names actually. Green version, blue version, that's what we're calling them for now. And we have our pre-order benefits here, which we will have a look at as well. Oh, I like the pattern on the back here. What is that called? Gingham, Britain's Bake Off. They're always like, present it on the gingham. Yeah. Okay, all right, so let's think about how we're gonna present that. Um... <laughs> I'm English, but when I try to like pretend to be English, I put on the shittest English accent. Oh, I can like see my face. Hello. Two of my new friends. There we go. The two versions. So I ended up getting two sets because two sets means four albums. There are four members of Toz. So I get four pre-order benefits. The maths, maths. <laughs> Unfortunately, there's not a big fan base here. Sad. So for debut, I bought six albums and I managed to win a fan call with all of the members which is crazy. I don't think I've ever won a fan call with that little albums before. Felt very blessed to be able to speak to them. They were so, so cute. Um, a couple of them aren't super confident with English. So I ended up just kind of showing them like plushies that I had and we just kind of like smiled at each other for like a minute, which was a little bit awkward, but it was really fun. And my favorite member, um, Haruto was really fun. He could speak English and he was just so slay and was like mocking my Australian accent and stuff. Um, so yeah, I had a lot of fun. So I reckon let's take a look at the MakeStar pre-order benefits first. I can't actually remember what the theme of these is, so it'll be a, a big surprise to me too. It's not Bake Off? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Gingham Bake Off. But speaking of that, like I kind of like the contrast between, you know, this kind of 
gingham, like very like preppy kind of print. And then the text for two and my new friends is like really, I don't know, goosebumpsy. So it's kind of cool that it's got this kind of contrast, I feel like. Preppy and then goosebumps, kind of creepy like font vibes. Um, I'm really digging that. And the color contrast is nice too. So yeah, we've just got the four photo cards, make style on the bottom here in the green. Um, let's just turn them over and like see who we get and see what the theme is here. Give me like a number between... What, one and four? No, no, no. <laughs> I want to be like, bat, 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 bat. Between one and 20. One so, and 15. Your birthday, 14. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 12, 13, 14. All right, we'll start with this one. I don't so know. Doesn't that give the middle ones like <laughs> a chance of the outside ones? Mm, am I supposed to do it like that then? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. It's the same one. <laughs> <laughs> I know I said the maths was mathing. Maths was mathing before. It's not. It never is. Right, let's go. Oh my god, these are so cute! This is Takuto, he is the youngest member in Toz. Look how adorable this is. It's almost like those Japanese style photo booth pictures where they then go in and like draw in little designs and stuff over their picture. These are so cute! Look at that! You remember how we did these in Japan? I don't like that. <laughs> it's like a game show. Oh, I, I actually love this so much. Oh my God, I really hope they're all like this because this is actually one of like the best concepts I've seen in, in a pub before. <laughs> I'm very excited about this. Toz, they are actually all um, Japanese, but this particular comeback was a song that was in Korean. So they performed on Korean music shows, whereas at debut, they released a full Japanese album and they didn't actually promote on Korean television. So I was actually pretty excited to see them on music shows. They did so, so well. Um, I could see their confidence. Their confidence has grown so much, especially Takuto, like on Boys Planet, um, you know, he was quite shy and not super confident in his dance and his singing, but the amount that he's improved is honestly, so inspiring and yeah I really think people need to get into Toz and see these idols doing like, there's a, a really great job at what they're doing like I'm so happy for them I'm so so proud yay okay I'm so excited to see the, the other ones with these <sighs> okay All right give me another number <laughs> one uh <laughs> like, one <laughs> I could start from wherever <laughs> one all right let's go with this one there we go, we have Huruto. And again, it is this style where he's gone in and drawn little things on here. Sweet potato, coffee, a little strawberry, 15, a little lucky clover, a heart star. And then I'm not sure what this Japanese character is. And he's got like a little, oh my God, my favorite lollipop. Strawberries and cream, chop chop. My favorite, you know I love those. This is the perfect photo card. Oh my God, I'm obsessed with these. And I like that the background is that same like, gingham that I keep calling it. Everyone's gonna be like, what the fuck is gingham, Kate? What are you talking about? These- All the Bake Off stands are gonna be like, yeah, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bake Off K-pop crossover. Never seen it before. Maybe I'm like crossing new grounds here. Honestly obsessed with these. Let's get into the next one. Give me a number. One. <laughs> <laughs> You're so fucking annoying. One. All right, we'll just, mm, let's go with this one. We have Yuto, here we go. Looking cute, little puppy ears, puppy paws, and little nose, and the little like, little cheek blushes here. I'm pretty sure this says I love you. Oh my God, I'm so smart. I can read. <laughs> no, I love it. It's super cute. Have they gone with like themes? This is kind of cat theme, strawberry theme, and puppy theme. I really wonder if they drew these themselves. I hope they did, because that's really like a really nice personal touch for these photo cards. Ah, oh, I love these. Honestly, if a big group did something like this, these photo cards would be worth like a fucking fortune. Like I'm not even kidding. Like if ATs or like Stray Kids or something did these, no joke. Give me a number. Uh uh, square root of negative one. What is that? One? I. <laughs> <laughs> I. I? The limit does not exist. Ah, Anthony. What is this? Is this another cat or a bear? Two paz. Topaz. Topaz. <laughs> Two paz. 
Topaz is the name of Toz's fandom. So he's written that on there and drawn like little whiskers and little ears on himself and little hearts, stars. The man or the bear? Let's not bring that up <laughs> in a fun K-pop video where we are looking at a group of very cute idols that are not controversial. <laughs> These are so cute. I don't even know which one's my favorite. I think just because I saw like Tokido's first, like that really caught me off guard because I had no idea what they were gonna look like and I fucking screamed, but they're all really great. I love them a lot. I, I, I really think, I really feel like every group should do this kind of photo card because I'm like losing my mind right now. Oh my God, I really like them. Josh. <sighs> oh, I really like them. <laughs> When I won the fan call last time, I got like signed albums by all the members. And then I also got like a signed Polaroid and Anthony signed that one. It was random. So I could have like a little display. It would be really cute with these photo cards and like my signed Polaroid and my album and stuff. That could be really cute. I literally have no space. So cute. Should we get into the albums then? We have to zoom out a little bit. Oh, one of them's upside down. All right, fine. Okay, I don't know if these have different names for the versions. It's blue version and green version, look on the bottom. Yeah, oh it is. So they actually are just called blue version and green version. First mini to my new friends. Which one should we start with? Vote in the comments down below. Blue because green's better. I mean, yeah. So we'll go with the blue version here. Let's have a look at the front. To my new friends, new shoes. It's got like a little list of all the songs here. New shoes, turning point, hello my world. Um, a song that I can't read and agit, agit. Um, I have listened to all these songs. Um, they're all very upbeat, peppy, summery tracks. That's what Toz does and they do it so well. I really wouldn't expect anything less from them. I think New Shoes is honestly such a fun song. I'm kind of obsessed with that at the moment. And I've also decided that our cat Pooby loves Toz and loves New Shoes because she just gives that energy. I don't really know how to explain it, but she really does give New Shoes energy. <laughs> she does. Like, how is this not Pooby energy? So as I said, it kind of looks like a shoe box. Like on the side here, this kind of looks like the barcode where you'd have the, the sizing information and all that, but it's like two my new friends, first mini blue version, and then the names of the members, 2024, Wire Entertainment, little barcode, nothing here, nothing here. And here's just like the spine. Um, I guess you display it like that. And you just see a big T. Oh, they both have a T. So it's not like they make um, a picture or anything if they're in a line, they both just have the T on there. And the back, pretty simple. The same as the front really, but they've just made it a bit more prominent with this white background. That's it. Let's get into the plastic. I am excited. I like you with new shoes. Eee! I know there's at least one Toz fan out there that commented on one of my videos. So I hope you're watching. I really hope more people will get into them. Maybe after they watch my video. Who knows? Now that the plastic's off, it looks different. Like there's a lot of different like prints and textures going on here. Let's open it up. Hopefully there's no photo cards just sitting right on the top. Okay. All right, so you open it up and you have a student information card on the front here, which I'm assuming is random. It is random. And we got Anthony. That makes a lot of sense because I tend to pull a lot of Anthony inclusions. So <laughs> I'm not very surprised by that. It always seems to come for me. And this is kind of cool though. So your information, I can't read any of this. <laughs> Wait, name? Oh, okay. So it's got his name in English, Korean, and Japanese. Birthday, nationality, MBTI, ESFJT. That is very different from mine. I am I-N-F-J. Oh, I guess it's not super different. But yeah, I'm definitely not an extrovert, um, but Anthony definitely is. This is really nice quality paper, actually. And yeah, unfortunately, I don't know what the rest of this says, but I'm sure it's some um, interesting information. 
How about Anthony? I really like the photo, it's very cute. He's got little stickers on his face. Speaking of stickers, <laughs> we have a sticker sheet here. Oh, okay. So these stickers might be random too because there's only two members' names on here. That's interesting. So we've got Yuto and Takuto on here. Does that mean maybe the other version has stickers with the other two members? I'm not sure. Or maybe there's two sets of stickers per album. Oh! Oh my god. I just saw him. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I already saw the photo card. That's so fucking sad. So here's your photo book. And underneath the photo book, there was all the inclusions just sitting here. We have the CD. New shoes, toes, toes, to my new friends. It feels thick. Shit thick. And I don't think there's anything under here. This is literally just padding. Um, am I gonna try and break it to see if there's any, anything under here? No. Is that another foam circle? Yeah, sure is. Lovely foam circle that you feel like you're gonna snap the fucking CD on every time you open it. Should we have a look at the photo book first? So we've got just a blue photo book with Toz in this kind of, what do you call this? Font. There's a lot of like nice finishing on this. Like this didn't have to be shiny, you know? Oh, they're so cute. Is that the same picture? Oh no. He's eating an orange in this photo. <laughs> He's not eating an orange in this photo. <laughs> a group of guys like having fun together, eating, playing games, all that kind of stuff. I, th I like it, I think it's cute. I really like the orange hair. I'm not really sure why they decided to make both Anthony and Tokoto like orange at the same time. Like that was a weird choice in my opinion, but they both pull it off really well. Oh, he honestly was so nice to me when we spoke on the phone. He seemed like genuinely happy that I was talking to him and that I'd like bought their albums, which was really nice. I, you know, he might have just been pretending, but he seemed super genuine. So if he wasn't being genuine, then he's a very good actor and he'll have a job after being an idol, I guess. Why would you put mustard on chips? That's fucked up, dude. I really feel like eating all of these snacks that they're eating. Oh, you see these groups that are kind of put together after survival shows. You know, these four, I think, were chosen to go together because they were all Japanese idols, obviously, all on Boy's Planet all like had some aspect of popularity from the show. And yeah, so they were just kind of grouped together. And it makes you think like, do they actually get along? Like, are they having a good time? Like, so I really hope they are. It seems like they are. Oh, he's just so adorable. I love the little denim beret with the little badges. That's very cute work. The adventure begins. All these pages are like very, None of them are different materials. It's all just like very papery, like no shiny or anything. So it does seem like quite a sort of standard photo book, which is okay. It's just making me very hungry because I want pretzels. Oh, yeah. So you can see clearly here, like they kind of have almost the same shade of hair, which is a very interesting choice, especially for a group with so little members. They've got like little uniforms on with their name tag. So you can see their heart. Um, it says stage name on the tag there. Lollipops. Is this supposed to be a balloon of the character? So there's the bear and then there's a balloon of the bear. Bubbles. This is just so, so cute. I love this hair on him. This Oreo hair. At the back, you've just got the lyrics at the back with the different songs and who wrote all the songs and things like that. At the back? At the back, at the back. Looks like Haruto did some of the rap lyrics on New Shoes, which is cool. And there we go. That's your photo book for that one. Let's have a look at the inclusions. Looks like we've got some sort of um, like keychain here. Maybe we can look at them one by one. Okay, so the first bit is just a strip with the names of all the members on there. Maybe this one will be personalized. I'm not sure. It is not. Okay, so just a little keychain with a bookmark type thing with the members' names and then to my new friends and Toz. I mean, if you put this like on your back or something, it's not gonna last very long, is it? Cause it's just like laminated cardboard. You know, I guess it's something. It's not a bookmark. But why does it have a keychain thing on it? It has to hang outside the book. See, I'm not too sure about that. It's not my favorite. I mean, I guess you could put it like in your car or something around your 
mirror. That might be okay. But if you had it on your there bag, you I've got my beautiful picture of Swan in the middle of my Swan on my mirror. And yeah, Swan it keeps me safe while I drive. And then we have two photo cards and um, with very different backs here. I don't know which one it was that I saw before, but I kind of hope that I can get that one first. I feel like it might be this one. So let's have a look at this one first. Okay, no, I was wrong. <laughs> Here he is again, Anthony. He is coming for me all the time. I like this photo card, this is cool. It's got like an orange jumpsuit on to go with his orange hair and some sort of orange ring as well. Um, very interesting outfit, a jumpsuit, but then also with a denim shirt underneath and a, a paisley tie. I don't know if I've ever seen this combination before, but you know, he can pull it off. The facial expressions, very cute. So the other one must be that um, Haruto one that I saw before, and it is. Here he is in his little uniform with his heart name tag and Oreo hair. I'm very happy to get these two. These these two are probably my, my favorite members in the group. So very good pulls for me. I really wanna see what the other ones are like, if they've got pictures of all of them in orange and pictures of all of them in, in the um, uniforms. I'm sure they do. So I will definitely have to look up a template and see what the other ones look like, but very happy with these pulls. Not too sure about this <laughs> dodgy keyring bookmark car charm though. I kind of hope there's a different inclusion in place of this in the other version, to be honest. The real analysis begins. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cute. Okay, let's move on to green version. Two, my new friends, first mini. The front, exactly the same as the blue one, just green. Got that shoebox design with the songs on the back, the big T on the side. The green definitely looks nicer compared to the blue. Like you can't really see all the detailing and stuff with the blue as well. It just pops more. Let's get into it. Whoa! Feels nice. Okay, I gotta remember that the inclusions are just underneath that student page, if that's what they're doing for this one too. Yay, Haruto! Okay, great, we're getting good pulls. Here is my bias here. His little student card, his name in English, Korean, Japanese, birthday, MBTI, ENFJ. What did I say, I was again? INFJ. So we're the same, but he's an extrovert and I'm introvert. That's cute, I'm sassy. <laughs> The unexamined life is not worth living. I don't know what the question was, but that answer is kind of a vibe. The unexamined life is not worth living. What does that even mean? What does, what that, does mean? that mean? Child. I don't want to think too deeply about stuff. I do K-pop to escape reality. I don't do it to think more about life. Can you see them? I think it was under the photo book. Oh, okay, it was. <laughs> Seems like the stickers are different from each other in the versions and the members are different. So this one has Anthony and Huruto. The other one had the other two members. So they've just split up the members between the stickers, between the versions. That was a really long explanation of something very simple, but you know what I mean. <laughs> version specific? Version specific stickers. I think I like these ones better. The color scheme is a lot more my kind of vibe, the purple and the green. 100%. Do you guys agree with me? Like aren't these ones way better than these ones? Put in the comments. <laughs> what do you think? Team green, or team blue. All right, you can have a look and see. So are they there? Can we just get them out? Yeah. Just put them face down on the tape. There you go. And all the okay. bookmark is the same. Oh, I fucking hate this stupid bookmark. Book, book, book. <laughs> book, book. Just a CD on this little piece of foam. I'm 100% sure there's nothing underneath here. Do you want me to break it open? No. No, I'm not breaking it the open. The whole thing is that you always go to break it open. <laughs> there's <laughs> gotta be something in there. That's why they've made it hard to get in there. I just wanna destroy things. This weird bookmark slash key ring slash car thing. Not a vibe. I'm really not loving it. I mean, at least it is different to the other one but not by much. It might have been nicer if they were personalized to a member, but then I guess it is just one more thing to collect. I'm not complaining though, because some of the groups that I collect have gone so crazy these days. Like I won't get into it, but zero base one are giving me strife right now. I'll just say that much. Um, but yeah, not too happy with this, but that's okay. Let's have a little look at the photo book. Same as before, but in green. 
I really do love the green a lot more. Let's see if I enjoy the photos more. Yes, I do, because I remember these concept photos with the dinosaurs and they're so cute. They're just playing with like, <laughs> I really love them. <laughs> with little plastic dinosaurs, look. And these outfits are so random. It's like they went to some 70s thrift market and just like picked the first five things that they found and put them on. Obsessed. His eyes look so big. Oh, <laughs> With the dino in the forefront. <laughs> the little heart with the dino. Yeah, this version is way better. If you're thinking about buying one version, definitely get the green one. Yeah, there's gonna be a surplus of blue. <laughs> no one buys blue just because of me. I don't think I'm that much of an influencer. Oh. They're just the cutest. <laughs> wow, this is the good acting that I was talking about. <laughs> like I love the color and then when it's tied off, it's just so cute. Oh. Do nothing club, that's such a fucking mood. Oh, when I spoke to them, I told like Hart, I was like, you have to look after Takuto because like he's really young and I just like worry about him being in the industry. But I know that Hart will take good care of him. So I was like, please take care of him. <laughs> like that's so lame of me to say, but uh, he seemed happy that I was like so supportive of him and of Takuto. And I was like, I want to just tell him like how much of a good job that he's doing. And then Hart was just like, yeah, he's not going to understand you. <laughs> he just literally cannot speak any English. It's like, you have to speak very slowly for him to understand. Um, but no, he had no idea what I was saying, which is sad. But I'm sure the smile on my face would have told him that I was like happy to see him. So I think that's all that matters, right? This version is so superior. Oh, okay. So like the last one they had like a bear and this one they've got like a little rabbit plushy thing. This one doesn't have a human in it though. The bear one had a human in it, right? It was like a, a bear suit that a human was in. There's no human in this bunny, I don't think. <laughs> they got like a sporty kind of look here. So they had like a school uniform type thing. This is more like a sport school uniform, I think. Oh, I love the glitter on the face. Oh. <laughs> eee. Yeah, they all have glitter and like little decorations. I love that. Eee. That happens every time I get to the end of a photo book. I'm like, whoop. Oh. And again at the back, the lyrics and the songs. Cute. All right, let's get into the photo cards. Oh, it's different to the other one. So the other version, we had one that looked like this. So we have two that have the same back. So that's kind of weird. I don't know what the template looks like for these photo cards, but it seems like there's two different types of photo cards. I thought there might be like one of these in each and one of these in each, but it doesn't look like that. So let's have a look and see what we get for the green version. Which one should we start with? <laughs> this one? All right, let's go. Anthony, what a surprise. <laughs> Here he is again in his 70s inspired thrift shop outfit doing a little salute and his eyes look so big as always and the orange hair just really suits him. I love it. It's great. I don't think I would be able to pull off this outfit, but you know, it's a vibe. Maybe the other one will also be Anthony. <laughs> Do we think? Shall we have a guess? I feel like it's going to be... I feel like it's going to be Yuto. I'm not going to lie. I think it is. Let's see. Oh my God. I seriously feel like I can read photo cards. <laughs> I think it's my special skill. <laughs> it's him, come on. This one, he's got like the little dino toy in the photo card, which is really, really cute. And like a little tweed suit. So many layers here. Well, it's got like a denim shirt, a little vest, tie, tweed suit, jacket. Yeah, I mean, it's, it would be perfect for the weather in Melbourne right now. It's fucking cold. But yeah, super cute. Looking at these photo cards really makes me want to see what the other member versions look like because if, you know, all of the members have a photo card holding a dinosaur toy, that's like a really nice set to collect. If they were all had ones like in orange jumpsuits, again, that's a really nice set to collect. It just seems like they're set up to have really nice sets to collect. <laughs> Set up nice to have sex 
you know what I mean. They're really visually appealing photo cards, so I'm I'm really happy with these photo cards for real. I'm just still kind of confused about the um, the back of these. So these are all my photo card pulls from Toz's new album, To My New Friends. We have the blue photo book version photo cards here and the green at the bottom. And these are the Megstar pre-order benefits that I got. I'm so happy with these photo cards. They're all super cute, especially the Megstar pobs. These are some of the best photo cards I think I've ever seen. Let me know what you think of them. I'm really interested to know if you enjoy this style. I hope you enjoyed my unboxing of the new album from Toz. I really love them. I think they're a super cute, talented group. And if you haven't listened to them, please go check out New Shoes right now. If you like unboxing videos, I've got heaps more to come. So please consider liking and subscribing. Let me know what you've been unboxing lately and I will catch you in the next video. Bye. That's not coming out again, <laughs> I'll tell you what. Mom, can you go fix your hair? I wasn't expecting to win. And I was like, oh shit, I've got to talk to these <laughs> fucking kids. Perfect, any cases of Amethyst and Magic Mission, we are going to fill in a box, we better have a puzzle. Hi, baby. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I want you to edit it like, Anaconda! <laughs> like that. <laughs> <laughs> Unboxing Bonanza! Oh god, how embarrassing. Fucking stray kids. Saturday night, just hanging out, talking to a camera about K pop. <sighs> 33 years old. Sorry, my, I feel like my head's gonna get into the shot. I'm like trying to. Ah, oh, I just really love them. Oh, keep them here so they're in our shot. Okay, here. okay. I really don't want to put them away. These poor boys, like they just have to dye their hair to holy hell. I think I've gotten the address off here. <laughs> so. <laughs> just blur that out. <laughs> Imagine if we're like, so I threw it towards the camera it, and, and like, it like opens up. <laughs> <laughs> Just dogs. <docks. laughs>